What's the one in place here, and welcome back to another video. Today we will be playing through more of the biggest Blitzkrieg in history. Gaming Blitzkrieg in history, I suppose. I mean, I don't even know if it's that, but whatever. Let's go with the title. Um, so, it's turn four. No corruption so far. Yay. Oh, wait, hold on. That reminds me. Let me... <laughs> I should have done this beforehand. My mistake. I just want to make sure that there's a save. Okay, anyways. Um... I accidentally impulse moved this ship here. This was my only move of the turn, but I saw that this dock was open, so I did that before I turned on the camera, just out of pure instinct. I apologize for that. Yeah, let's go ahead and get into this. Oh, no. The, uh, the Denmarkians. No. That's, that's, that's not. Danish? No. Wait. What do you call people from Denmark? I'm actually not sure, now that I think about it. Like, I, mm. I feel like I should definitely know this. I don't know why I don't. Oh, well. Excuse me. Um, so yeah, let's build up our navy some. I wonder if we've gone to war with anyone new. No? We're cool with everyone still? Okay, that's pretty tight. Um, oh yeah, you might notice, I have quite a bit more land claims this time around than, uh, I did in the original version. That's because, uh... I managed to use more than 10 of my brain cells, I know. Big accomplishment, especially for me. But yeah, I was a tactical thinker, you know, that's kinda rare on my part. And I managed to do more damage to the enemies. We're going to pull that up right now. You see, I took much bigger parts of Poland this time around, and it was, it was just overall a better play on my part. And I'm happy for that, because I managed to be smart for once, yay. Let's see if I can get into there. I just used better movement was mainly it. Like, where I moved, everything was a bit more precise, I suppose. Is there an airport? Okay, this is level one. Not sure if I may... Uh... And that's... Uh... Okay, we're going to have to take that next turn then. That's unfortunate. Anyways, or... No, the Russians are going to take it before me. That sucks. Okay. Anyways, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the bug. Only affects level 2 airports. I'm not really sure why it does that. But yeah, only level 2 ones. And if you have a rocket factory or a nuclear factory in that uh, same city and it's a level 2 airport, you can still use the factory. I think it's just like the uh, developer didn't code the level 2 factories properly. And so it kind of messes up whenever you try... Not factories, uh, airports properly. So it messes up whenever you try to use it. Which, I mean, is very unfortunate, but it's whatever. Whenever you know about the glitch, it's not that bad. Unless you are an idiot and misclick like me. So, yeah. Yikes. Uh, otherwise, yeah, not that big of a deal. It only affects those particular airports. And, like I said, there are ways around it. We've conquered Warsaw. This is good. This is very good. That means that now, basically, Poland is kind of ours. Uh, did, did, did the Russians turn? The Russians did not turn. I'm surprised. I was expect expecting that to be a trigger. Oh, okay. I'm fine with that, though. Um, I'm... So, my first video I was recording, I was at my granny's. Now I'm back at my house. Because, uh, I'm moving soon. So I'm kind of just back over here to pack some stuff and whatever. And, uh, yeah. That's... I mean, I guess that doesn't really matter to y'all. <sighs> Level 2 airport. Why? See, this would be so much better. If I could just use the proper airports, but I can't. I can't, I can't, I can't, and that's horrible. What was I in the middle of saying? Oh, yeah. Um, so, basically, I'm over here now. It's You guys aren't really going to notice a difference because it's all done on my phone because I'm broke. So, yeah. No real differences. Just figured I'd talk about it. But, yeah. You might be noticing a difference in this video, though. And that difference is the sound of silence, except for my soothing voice i'm i'm sure you all agree with that Man. basically i had two videos get copyright claim and i was like what nah no way that's a fake claim and then i checked it now i was like nope it's because of the soundtrack in these games in these particular mods it was this mod and nuclear war mod but i'm going to be turning it off in all mods as a just in case because i don't I'm a small creator. I There's no reason for ads to be on my videos in the first place. And I'm definitely not going to have ads that I'm not getting revenue from, you know? Like, yeah, it's just, uh, it sucked. 
Especially whenever I found out that, yeah, it actually was my fault. So, that's where we're at now. All you have to do is listen to my voice, which means I have to talk even more. And of course, if you look at my earlier videos, you know how very exceptional I am at that. Where you get about two minute breaks of silence. It's amazing, isn't it? Just absolutely breathtaking. I am breathtaking, God. I am... Not sure if you guys have seen it, it was a video making fun of how long it took Cyberpunk to release. And it was basically just, uh, why can I not think of that name? It, uh, how am I not thinking of that name? John Wickman, I should know his name. That Keanu Reeves, there we go. For some reason his name completely slipped my mind, and that was actually about to like infuriate me because I should know it. Anyways, what was I, oh yeah. So basically, it was just Keanu Reeves slowly getting more and more modified body parts as the years went on. Until eventually he traveled to the future to get the game. And traveled back in time. And it was literally just him waiting again. It was hilarious. Like, the game was him waiting. It was great. But, um, let's see. That's, hmm. Yeah, there we go. More breaks of silence. Y'all's favorite, right? I've noticed, like... My videos, a lot of people are not subscribed, which, yeah, kind of makes sense with my upload schedule. I'm not going to lie to y'all. But, um, it would be nice if you did subscribe. I know that definitely not very active. But if you could overlook that and be fine with an upload every 10 years, or, like, you know, it's more like about 10 uploads every three, every other third month. So, I mean, you're getting something. You're getting more than some creators, I suppose. But, yeah, if it, you could, guys could just subscribe, I suppose. If not, that's fine. I understand. It's... Oh, God, I'm breathing a lot in this video. That's ugh, terrible. <laughs> it's terrible that I'm breathing. But as I was saying, um, I understand I don't really subscribe to a lot of people who aren't as active. There's a few exceptions. And, oh my God, why am I breathing so much? Anyway. There's a few there's a few exceptions, but not very many. So I understand if you don't want to subscribe, but if you would, that would be nice. I want to maybe I don't know, getting to a hundred would be pretty cool, I think. And I'm not sure if my content is even good enough for that. My thumbnails kinda aren't the best if you haven't noticed, but I don't know. I feel like I could get to a hundred and maybe beyond that. No idea, but that's the goal, I guess. This is really just kind of a side hobby, if I'm being honest. Like, at the moment, anyways. It's just kind of a... I'm doing this because I want to. It's fun. I'm playing these games anyway, so I may as well share it with people. And I find sharing games with people to be more fun. Why am I freaking so much? I sound like a complete and total doofus. I apologize to all you lovely people at home. All four of you. <laughs> because, yeah, it's just... I don't know. I, this is a hobby, I suppose you could say, I'm going to be playing these video games anyways, I'm going to be interacting with these mods anyways, so I may as well, you know, put some videos online. I feel like I'm more of a part of a community whenever I do that, you know? How is the progress going? I feel like we haven't conquered anything. Well, we conquered Warsaw, I believe. Yeah, we did that. Riga's gonna fall next round. And Zara, and Zara, and... Anzra, Anzra, that's what I'm calling that, yep, we can take that, we could probably take this, we could take an airport that's not level 2 as well, but you know, can't have nice things, oh yeah, we have to move all these guys up, whoops, I'm gonna try and get rid of the generals, the generals are always like, a... in mods, generals are oftentimes overpowered, or they do nothing, it's one of the two, which is kind of, like, it's unfortunate, because in the game itself, generals do a lot. They're kind of one-man armies. It's not like glory of generals where generals don't matter at all. But even though they're one-man armies, they're not super OP. Like, you don't have a general that just has, like, a thousand health, you know? So, yeah, a little bit more balance might be nice. I don't know. I mean, it's fun. So maybe it's good. I don't know. I kind of play World Conqueror 4 and all of its mods and stuff separately, like, how do I explain it? 
World of Conqueror 4 is the game I want to go to whenever I just want to destroy stuff. Well, Glory of Generals is the game I want to go to for actual strategy and being like, okay, how do I solve this puzzle? Because that's basically what it is. It's a puzzle in GOG3. Let's see if... We're... Currently, we're doing pretty good. Oh my goodness, I almost forgot. There is a World of Conqueror 4 update coming out and it should be coming out sometime this month and i am super excited about that i am all about that because like it's just awesome i just i'm excited it's going to be great i hope maybe uh, who knows can't really know until it happens but i hope that it's great i feel that it can be great and i am excited because of that because World Conqueror 4 is one of my favorite games that's made by Easy Tech. I'd say that my games that I play by Easy Tech. Well, oh, I left that open. It's mainly Glory of Generals. Or no, it's completely Glory of Generals and World Conqueror. I never really got into the European War series. I'm just not as big into that part of history, you know? So never really got into it as much. I told one of my friends on the EFC forum that I might get into it some, but I don't know. It'd be cool, but I just, it's not really my cup of tea, I suppose. I heard that the map is a lot more accurate, and I know that in, uh, let's see, I believe it was European Wars 1914, the, uh, diplomacy is really good, I heard, which is a plus to me. I always think that games should have the best diplomacy possible. I want, like, every game to have civilization levels of diplomacy. Which, unfortunately, is not very possible. Oh, yay. Now I'm not breathing. I'm just making an obnoxious sound with my lips. What fun. Let's... <laughs> I feel bad for y'all. I don't know what's wrong with me today. I keep making sounds without trying to. Alright, let's move this around. But yeah, War Conqueror 4 update. It adds quite a bit of content from what I remember. It adds uh, fortresses. Don't know what that's about, but hey, seems cool. And maybe the fortresses can be upgraded or something, maybe? That'd be cool. Adds like 96 levels or something crazy like that. I think that might be the end of this turn, honestly. Ships are good. Everything's good. Uh, Yeah, okay, time to do turn 5. Odd numbers have bad luck. Either I run out of energy... Hold on. Let me make sure I have everything moved up over here. Yeah, no, never mind. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and keep invading those lines. That would be nice. What was that? Oh, yeah. Um, odd numbers seem to have very bad luck. Either I just run out of en en uh, huh? energy and sound awful <laughs> in the video, or there's the second option, which is the game corrupts. You know. The two best options. The two only options. Nothing else is allowed because why would I be allowed to have a break? Alright. Move these guys up to here. Who's on this? Wait, wait. Uh, not gonna pronounce that because it's with a V. Vi, vi, something. Something, something, something. That's what it is. You, sir, need to go up here. Okay. Everything is set. Everything is ready. Don't really see the need to move anything else. I'm excited to see, like, when the... Oh, yeah. You. You have a job. Go ahead and bomb that. See, that did a good amount of damage. I like that. Who Who's on here, actually, now that I think about it? Speer. I don't know who that is. I'm going to be honest. I'm learning about World War II. I know some about World War II. You guys were hearing me talk about World War II. But, um... Don't know the generals as well, if I'm being honest. I know about, like, the main battles, I guess. But, like, not really everyone who was involved. And I'm enjoying learning more about it, but it's just sometimes I feel very... Oh! They joined in. It's happened. I... Okay. So now we're fighting, like, everyone, it seems. I thought they were going to join in, like, one at a time or something. That's... Guess that's not how they did it in real life, so now I have to fight them all at once. Also, I'm surprised that there's no, like, text pop-ups, because they have that in the, uh, the conquest mode, where, like, it'll pop up with, like, you've done this, da 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 attack da 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 I'm surprised that they don't have that. I might have to play conquest just to show y'all an example of that. Because, like, conquering Paris is a big- oh, 
Oh, never mind. I have to take down this thing. Conquering Paris is a big deal. Oh, that's good. Hold on. Let me see. Oh, I messed myself up, though. That's unfortunate. Hold on, wait. Can we move? Hold on. Okay, so Belgium. No. No, 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 no. Belgium? I'm taking your port. Britain. I want to take your port, though I know that's very unlikely. Let's see. The damage done. Nothing. Nice. Yeah, no, that's gonna be a bit of a battle. Amsterdam. No, not Amsterdam. That's... <laughs> I do that sometimes, where I'll just call all of the Netherlands Amsterdam, and I'm not sure why that's a habit of mine, but it is. No! Oh my god. Whatever. Everything happens for a reason. Now, I can take this. Bam. That's like three or four ports that I've taken now. That's good. I need as many of those as I can take. Why? Because it gets hectic if you don't have them. Like, extremely so. Why are you people... Why are you sending people downwards? I don't like that. I don't like you. Let's see. I'm going to try and take this one next. Q. Die, please. Thank you. So that's going to be the next port I take. But yeah, we're going to want to build up a lot, a lot of reinforcements. Not, not reinforcements, per se. What's the word I'm looking for here? We're going to want to take that guy out, that's for sure. But um, we're going to want to build up a lot of ships, so that way their navies don't completely pommel us and stop any ad troop advancement. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. It seems like we're doing good with naval buildup. Not great, but good. And right now, I'm okay with good. Because, I don't know. Settle for less kids. <laughs> That's terrible advice. Don't do that. You, sir. Who can you go attack? Tell No. You know what? I don't need you to attack any of them. You're going to go and help supply our, uh, not flanks. That's not the word I'm looking for. I'm glad I insta-killed that because you're supposed to move them two feet away because, you know, be smart. You people are going to go supply over here. That's the word I'm looking No, that's not the word I'm looking for. Go help kill the country. I've lost all words for what to call them. That's great. I love that. That's my favorite. Okay, let's move over here. So yeah, currently it looks like we're gaining a bit of a stronghold on the naval side of combat, which is great. That's very important. As for over here, huh, what can we take? We can take this, for sure. There we go. What else? That was not taken. That's surprising. Okay. Hmm. Oh, are we at war with Yugoslavia yet? No, we're not. Wow, that comes later. Okay, I'm fine with that. That was that's surprising. All right, let's go ahead and build more submarines. Submarine, submarine, little black sum. No, oh, no, let's not get copyrighted. <laughs> Goodness. I still can't believe I got copyrighted. The copyright was on, like, my biggest video, too. The, like, only video I have that reached 100. I'm so mad about that. It's so dumb. Why are you gonna copyright this freaking, like, nobody? I have 34 subscribers. And most of y'all are people who don't even watch anymore. Let's be honest here. Most of you people I'm talking about will not see this video. And it's as simple as that. And it's like, bro, really? I don't even know how they found me. How did they find me to copyright me? Because I'm non-existent. <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Totally. Who can we all take out? So we want to focus on, like, kind of the cannon fodder? I don't know. I'm not really sure the strategy to use, if I'm being honest. The Darien, where are you at? Uh, good luck. Also, the big boy tanks. They have a three attack range, which is perfect. Okay, let's... I, I thought I killed you. Man, you have terrible movement. Okay. So we're gonna take this guy with this guy. 
and we're gonna move our troops upwards and onwards to try and take this guy. And maybe, I don't know, we could take this guy. And then Russia's gonna turn aggro on us, most likely. And when that happens, I don't know, bro. That's gonna be difficult. Where's Moscow? There's Moscow. I think. I'm surprised. I feel like... Hmm. Usually they have, like, the leaders guarding the stuff. The uh, capitals. But I guess not for this one. Okay. I mean, I'm not gonna complain about that. Alright, let's go ahead and take Geneva. Let's go. Violate... Can't violate the conventions. If the place doesn't exist. Alright, let's see. And then, bam. Kill them. And now we can take it. Beautiful. Absolutely riveting. Now where to go? Hmm. Upwards is my sit no. We take Leon. That's the play. That's definitely the play. Let's see. We want to move whoever's furthest back. So that maybe, if we are extremely lucky, we can possibly take the city. I doubt it's going to happen. But it can happen. It might happen. It happened. Oh my goodness. Okay. Leon, now ours. Geneva is also ours. No more conventions. No more stuff that happens in Leon that I'm sure totally does happen. I don't know. So we have invaded from Switzerland. Or Switzerland, whatever. Which I'm sure they were not expecting at all. We have artillery bombardments ready they do no damage for some reason also no damage this is kind of kind of letting me down here it's kind of sad that's like a troop transport that's not really okay whatever now we maybe take this we do not take amsterdam okay Instead, we take Rotterdam. That's the one that I was going for. Yes, totally. Nothing else ever. So if we take this, and we take Belgium... Ooh, I got hit. And we take Belgium, then we might be able to put a swift end to France. I think we can. But, uh... Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, I got a text from a friend. Sorry about that, y'all. Ooh, a thousand dollars. That's actually very useful. Let's see if we can take care of their navy right here. Because if we can get rid of... Because we took already... Oh, words. Nice. We already took one of their ports. So if we take another, that could lead in a big boy success. Oh yeah. Belgium. Maybe we can take this. I don't know. We're not going to have any rebels hiding out here this time. So I, th I think we're good. I still don't know why you have one of my generals, Belgium. Could you give him back, please? Oh, so can we take this godforsaken city? What's what's going on here? It's not even a general guarding it. Why do you have so much health, sir? Should be illegal. Okay. And now we move that guy up. And now we attack with our tank. And now we defeat them. Maybe? Yes. Okay. That's another city down. That's good. And now we can, hmm, do we t attack Bracelles or move downward to attack more fronts? It's a hard one. I think Bracelles might be a good idea. Get rid of the Belgians as a fighting force. I'm not sure if it'll get rid of them, actually, which is unfortunate to say the least. We have to actually kill all of them, I think, but oh well. But as long as we can do damage and just, like, take their capital, we should be fine. See, so yeah, I guess this is where the interesting part of stuff comes in. Because now there's actually large invasion, inva invasions. There we go. That's the word. So let's see how this all plays out, I guess. Nice. I think I just stole their capital, and that's why they're all demotivized, which, hey, good for me. Alright, let's see. Not here. Is this the one I stole the capital of? 
I can't tell. I don't know why they used the Soviet Union for all of them. I'm not, not sure about that part of history, actually. I don't know what that is all supposed to represent, and I feel dumb for not knowing, but oh well. It's fine, I guess. Right. Poland's gonna fall next turn, that's for sure. Need our guys up here. Okay. What other ri Oh yeah, WC4 update. I feel like I just kind of bounce around topics. That's exciting. All the new levels and stuff. The fact that it's all coming out like, I don't know. I'm just extremely excited for that. I hope that comes out for iOS and Android at the same time because otherwise as an Android user, yeah, I'm not getting that for a while. <laughs> Which would suck severely. None of the Russians are going to turn on us. I also go to turn two, but the end of the video will be the end of this turn. You know, turn two, turn six. I'll go to it in the video, but we won't play in it. That's how that sentence is supposed to be phrased. I swear my English is degrading as this video goes on. I apologize. Oh yeah, look for more uh, nuclear war content from me. I think that I'm going to be continuing that again. If I can remember where I left off and then I'm going to have to go watch my old videos, which I hate. I hate watching my old videos because I don't want to pad the view count of it, you know? It just feels wrong to me. Like, these aren't coming from unique people, you know? Wish there was a way to differentiate in the al uh, algorithm, but there's not, and it sucks. Let's just send forward. There we go. Right here. I think now it's really just moving troops. That's all that seems to need to happen, so let's go ahead and do that. Everyone moves upwards. We're going to have to fight the Soviet Union soon, but whatever, that's fine. I thought I could move them. Okay, it really sucks not having the music. The music was just such a motivator. Because they have such good music, but of course, it's copyrighted, so... Can't use it. I got copyrighted by two, like, two different videos. So mad about that. One of my top viewed videos with a whole hundred views. Like, I'm proud of that. I'm so proud of that. And like, it's just copyrighted. I can't... If you see ads on those videos, that's why. I can't produce ads. I don't have the ability to. Because I'm not a big boy. I'm not considered a big boy by YouTube. It's very unfortunate. I have to have a thousand subscribers and like 4,000 hours of watch time or something like that before I'm considered a big boy. Which also, 4,000, my goodness, that's a lot of watch time that they expect, like, people to accumulate. I don't know, it just seems a bit much to me, but I guess maybe that's because I'm not a big boy. I don't know. Also, I think that I kind of miscalculated where Nazi is at, because I don't think most of my troops can reach it because of the mountains. So yeah, that's kind of, whew, kind of unfortunate. Ooh, going there. Okay, I've done damage. I've destroyed. Okay, cool. Now, hmm. If I can manage to destroy this little pocket right here in this turn, that'd be great. Let's see if I can do it. I'm actually thinking I might be able to. Let's move forward. Okay. Now one last check. Yes! Okay. Bam! I broke their lines. Let's go. What general is this? I need to know. Monstein! You beautiful, 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 beautiful man. I was not aware that that was Monstein I was using, but thank goodness it was, otherwise that may not have worked. I have now taken Nancy. Which is amazing. There we go. I'm slowly breaking the French lines, which is very, very good. And in multiple ways, too. Like, there's been multiple breakthroughs down here in Switzerland... Invading up, th so I'm probably going to invade downwards from Lyon into Toulouse and whatever. Spain, you're not looking too hot, lad. Oh, Spain is dead. I cannot help you guys. You getting pummeled by the communist Spaniards or the non? I I think they're communist. I don't know. They are now. <laughs> Hey, are you kind of getting pummeled over there, Spain? I don't know what to do to help you there. Okay, who can progress here? Ah, yes. Raid the capital. Paddy, your time is done. 
Okay. Probably take that city behind me, but I don't have the patience. I'm gonna be honest here. I think it's better that I just kind of rush forward to Paris. I'm going to get a big boy boost from that. I don't know why I've started using big boy. That's not common terminology for me, but whatever. I guess my friends have been doing it or something. Advance. Alright, and advance again. You, advance. Please, please? It'd be nice. There we go. Luxembourg. Alright, everything seems to be under control. Except over here. We need to bring these guys forward. So we broke through the line and took a city. We bypassed the line and took a city. And we bypassed the line and took a city. Very good outcomes, all of those. Surprised that we broke through. I actually wasn't expecting that, if I'm being honest. I was expecting to just kind of go around. But breaking through, definitely a good option. You, uh, fight them off, I guess, because you're not really fit for combat otherwise. So hey, you have a use now. Protect us from the, uh... People from up there, up here, I still don't know what to call people from Denmark. I'm very upset about that, and I'm probably going to get told in the comments. Oh yeah, take out the Polish right here. I, the Polish are basically through. Like, if we're being honest, there's not really anything they can do anymore. All my troops are moved up, basically. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, everything looks good. This whole line, looking snazzy. Very good. This line over here. A bit more jumbled, I will admit, but still looking pretty good. Yeah, I think we've got that. I think that's really all we need to do. We can move this guy down from Vienna. Oh, thank God that was the right airport. Oh, goodness. Didn't mean to click the airport, but... Utter step. Yes! Okay, these both have tier 3s. That's very good. Very, very good. Yeah, let's go ahead, go to the next turn and see what awaits us, and then the video will be, oh, it's not restart, <laughs> I almost pressed that. Oh, I tried to press the skip button, but it didn't work. Okay, let's see, hopefully... This will end pretty quickly. Maybe not. <laughs> I forgot how long this takes. Okay, let's see. Any new enemies? Any new challengers? No. None. Pretty chill over here. Uh, no, no, it's not. Yeah, no new enemies. We're moving through their land now, the French. It's going to be our next goal. Taking that out. Russia. We still cool. Oh. Oh no. Oh yeah, they've gone neutral. Okay, so we're gonna have to kick up production over here. Big time. Encircle any generals within our grasp because, yeah, they... They're all very neutral and that's very bad for us. I think these guys become our allies, maybe. And then this becomes our big bad guy on the east. East? Yeah. So yeah, y'all can expect that in the next video. I hope y'all enjoyed. Have a wonderful day and goodbye.